in any aspect of it, like as much proactive police work as we do, we're still being reactive to what they do, no matter what. So, all right, we change our tactics, we change this or that. We catch them one time, they're changing their shit up, and then we have to adapt and react to what that, we can't be, pro- I mean, we could be as much proactive as we want, but we're all basing it on what they're doing initially. So if the first time we catch, you know, someone that's involved in, in major shit, they're going to change up their MO to avoid us, to go at different times, different ways of concealing it, all that shit. 100%. I mean, times have evolved. If you look at the way that the drug game was done, you know, 20 years ago, compared to the way that it's done today, I mean, you're talking about uh, FaceTime calls, you're talking about dropping pins, you're talking about uh, no money for drugs, just drugs, and you're going to cash at me or Venmo me. I mean, it's a completely different game, and we just have to do our best to keep up with the times. You know, when you talk about training, it's a must because things are going to change. They're going to constantly change. Um, you know, the guy that graduated the academy 25 years ago and the guy that graduated the academy today, it's just it's a different world. Um, so 100%, it's, it's very different. 